Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kim. Thank you for joining me here today. I'm here today to talk you through our net worth update from the month of June 2022. Um, so if that is something you're interested in, then continue watching and I'll talk you through it. Okay guys, so what I'm going to do is talk you through our net worth value at the end of June 2022. So normally I would go and populate these figures on the go but I've already pre-populated them at the moment and I'm just going to talk you through them. And so the way that this spreadsheet works is it um, takes my assets and then minuses my liabilities and it gives me my total net worth. Uh, so for the month of June, our house valuation actually went up to um, $540,000. So that was a bit of a surprise considering the fact that we've seen quite a bit of a drop in the property market lately. Um, I was quite surprised to see the value had increased. So not complaining though. Um, Ben's superannuation, I have not actually had a chance to check with him what it was exactly at. So I just copied last month's across. Um, I'm assuming because he makes regular contributions to it that it would probably be kind of similar because obviously the super um well not just super but the stock market in general at the moment is not doing so well so i just left it as well as and i would try follow up with him for next month to see if i can get a more accurate figure um i have two superannuation accounts so in my first super account i have thirteen thousand and eighty three dollars and forty three cents um, this is the one that my employer contributes to and then once a year my financial advisor transfers over to my second super account which has seen quite a drop from last month and is currently sitting at $65,834.74. Um, so hopefully we start to see the stock market recovering soon and my super starts to grow again. Um, obviously not just me. Um, it's everybody. <laughs> um, our investment portfolio is currently sitting at $431.20. Now this has only gone up due to my contributions. It has nothing to do with it actually performing well. Um, we have $30,327.04 in our offset savings account. Um, we had quite a expensive month. We ended up spending about $5,000 out of our savings account. So yeah, it has dropped quite significantly, um, but it was all planned and budgeted for, which is nice. Uh, we currently have $1,269.94 in our everyday offset account. Uh, valuation has not changed for our vehicles. The Mazda is still worth $23,500 and my Subaru is still worth $22,400. So that gives us a total liability um, a value of $783,517.91 at the end of June 2022. Now, um, for our liabilities, we currently owe $1,000. Uh, $192,658.67 on the fixed portion of our mortgage, um, $170,127.89 on the variable portion of our mortgage, uh, $20,194.67 on my car loan, um, $21,974.94 on Ben's car loan, and we owe nothing on our credit card. Um, so this gives us a total liabilities of $404,956.17 um, as of the month of June. Um, now when the um, liabilities are subtracted from the assets. Um, this gives us a total net worth of $378,561.74. Uh, so this is definitely an increase from last month, but I reckon the only reason we saw the increase was purely for the fact that our house value went up by $10,000. So um, if it weren't for that, we would have dropped in our net value. Um, and yeah, this here is just 
this figure, the um, <laughs> the net worth in a bigger number because it makes me feel happy. <laughs> um, so if we go over to this side of the spreadsheet, uh, we can have a look and see what the change was. So um, in May, uh, our net worth was $374,186.20. Um, and when you subtract the current month's net worth, we have increased net worth by 400, uh, sorry, that, it, that would be nice if it was 400. We have increased our net worth by $4,375.54 for the month. So not a bad month um, considering the way things are going. Um, but yeah, so yeah, that's our net worth update for the month of June 2022. And that is it for my um, June net worth update. Um, hope that you enjoyed watching it. Um, I always find these kind of videos quite interesting. I like to see where people's gains and losses are um, and sometimes when things aren't going to plan due to you know the stock market or the property like valuation or things like that um sometimes it, i find it a little bit reassuring to know that everyone is in the same boat and you're not alone you're right there we have a little guest today apparently this is izzy <laughs> she is a king charles cavalier cross pomeranian and the only way i can get her to not bark while i'm filming is if she sits by my feet or is by my side the whole time so say hi Izzy. Hi. <laughs> anyway, thank you so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below. And don't forget to ring that little bell so you get notified of my videos in the future. Until next time, bye guys. <laughs>